Okay, I'm gonna vacuum seal in a one of these food saver bags three apples. My wife ate one, she said they're not that great. You know, kind of on the mushy side, but I'm just gonna check and see how these work for uh, keeping them fresh. Watched some sort of documentary or something where there was an apple company who had tons of apples and they would store them in a low temperature, low oxygen environment. So I figure if we vacuum seal, that takes out the oxygen and then I'll just put them in the cold storage and uh, we'll let some time pass and see how long they keep. Okay, I'm also doing a banana just for fun. Push the uh, pulse button. Uh, and some Roma tomatoes. The temperature in here is what? Just under 55, right about 55 degrees. Sometimes it gets a bit colder. So here we have some tomatoes, banana, apples, vacuum sealed. We'll come back every now and again and check and see how they're doing in the bags. I have no idea how this will work, but the lower the temperature, you don't want to go freezing because that ruins it. Just a bit above freezing, I think, is what the video said was the best. I don't have much hope for the banana. The apples, I think, will do really well, and I don't know about the tomatoes. So We have these. It should probably last a bit longer just because it's so cold in here. And uh, But they are exposed to the oxygen, so we'll see what kind of difference this makes. It's now two months later. It's about 44 degrees in this cold storage. And I... Got the fruit, let's check it out. Okay, the banana obviously did not make it. Here's the test tomato. It's pretty gross. This apple feels perfectly fine, and I don't see why these wouldn't either. Apparently the seal failed in these. Seems like there's quite a bit more air in there. But the seal on tomatoes held really well, so... And... As far as color and skin, they look pretty good, but we'll have to cut open the bag and see if tomatoes can last two months in the cold storage. See what it looks like inside. Actually, it's probably pretty edible still. I wouldn't want to eat it though. It's more like a. <laughs> it's pretty slimy. Gross. Alright. Mmm. There's a weird slime on the tomatoes or something like that. It's not slimy actually. It's like a, some sort of skin. But they feel pretty good. They're not mushy at all. So, I'll wash it off and cut it open. Oh, the tomatoes are a little mushy. But I think they're definitely edible. They don't smell very good though. They smell like grass. Ugh, I'll take a bite here.
Ugh. They taste like grass. Forget the tomatoes. And the apples seem just fine, so I'm going to let those go for even longer. We'll see how long they last.